Welcome, welcome to DL Outdoor, DL Outdoors. Um, this is going to be quick tip number 18. In this quick tip, I'm going to be saying places that to throw. We're going to be talking about a chatterbait. Um, for this, right, that that is a chatterbait for y'all that did not know. This one right here is actually a homemade chatterbait. Um, I have a, I know a guy that makes them all, that makes them and these really, we we have um, bought some from the store, and I personally have never caught one from a store bought one, but I've also caught, I've caught all my chatterbait fish off of these. So good places, to, good places to throw a chatterbait is going to be, um, first of all, it's going to be on the right there at the riprap on all the bridges. You want to throw there. Um, we go down to Lake Russell, and that's where we. That's where um, we catch a lot of fish at, is at the Rip Raft and other lakes, but Lake Russell we've caught a total, one day we caught like 10 fish there, and it was just using this chatterbait in like an hour or two. Um, also, you can throw it right there at the bridge columns. Now, it's, um, you all should know what that is, but what you wanna do is if you throw it past it and reel it, reel it past the column, sometimes them bass are like, are sitting there at the bridge column waiting for any type of bait fish or anything to swim by so they can get it. Um, we've actually caught a two pound bass by doing that. And one other place you can throw it is any around trees. Um, you can throw it on, you can throw it and reel it on top of the trees. Now for the depth of a chatterbait, it does go down eight foot. Um, you could let it sink if you wanted to, but if you throw it out there and start reeling it, it does go eight foot down but really that is all for this quick tip video that is three places where you can throw a chatterbait thanks for watching this episode of the outdoors and i'll see you on the next one